All right. Hi, everyone. Welcome to yet another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to withdraw your money from Pioneer at black market rates. The app we used in the last video is called Green Finance, and you can get access to it in the link in the description. So for Pioneer, most importantly, what you should know about withdrawing from Pioneer to Gray is that Gray does not support withdrawing USD uh, from Pioneer. However, you can withdraw using GPP and you can have access to your GPP account here. On Pioneer, what you do is you convert your USD to GPP or Euro. So once you do that, you now send it over to Gray.co. Now, Gray is going to give you an account that you could use. So you now take this account, take the details of this account, input it in Pioneer, and then add it as an account where you send money to. And that's it. Once you process a payment, it takes one to three hours for you to get to Gray Finance app. Now, once you've done that, all you have to do is to come over to these three dots and then you go to swap funds. Now, at this point, you now change this to your Nera account. Now, you change this to your Nera account. The next thing for you to do, let's say, for, for example, you sent in £1,000. So, you have £1,000. On Grey app, the rates are 880 Nera for one to one pound. You're going to get 876,000 Nera as the conversion. And they're going to take a fee of uh, £5.04. Now, this is super awesome because you're going to get them this this 876,000 naira straight into your Nigerian bank account. Uh, I showed you in the other video how to add your Nigerian bank account and all. But then let me show you that again. So you come over to more. Come over to cards and beneficiaries. Oh, before we do that, ensure if you get some value from this video, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to this channel and also click on the bell notification. I drop videos like this every single day. So by clicking the bell notification, you get notified when I drop yet another awesome video like this. Uh, before we get to adding your Nigerian bank account, ensure you verify your accounts. Firstly, verify your account and then also ensure that you do two-factor verification. Very important. Then you go now for you to add your Nigerian bank account. You go to cards and beneficiaries. Then you click on add new beneficiary. Now on here, you can change to Nigeria. Now just change to the Nigerian balance. You can select the banks here. There are so many banks here. Almost every every bank you can think of in Nigeria. Let's say, let's say we could take any bank. Then you impute your phone number, your bank account here. Once you imputed it, it will show you the name of the account, your name and everything. Then you just click on add bank accounts. And that's it. So you can send money directly to that account. Once you swapped your dollar to GPP on Payoneer, you send it to your GPP account on Gray. Now on Gray, you convert your GPP balance to your Nera. Now, once you've done that, you now take that balance that you've converted to Nera, you now send it to your Nigerian bank account and the money is in your bank account without any hassle. Now, this takes between one, one to five hours for you to process, even less than that. I'm just giving them optimal time. Uh, it's super awesome. It saves you a lot of time. I, I remember I had issues like this in the past whereby I had to go to the bank in person to withdraw the dollars. Then now look for a black market exchanger. Sometimes I get good rates. Sometimes I get terrible rates. So, but then this actually helps you to, uh, to be able to convert it at the comfort of your house without any stress at all. You don't need any black market exchanger. You just use great app um, i'll leave a link in the description and you get that done without any problem so that's it guys on this video i'll see you on the next one if you have any questions you can drop it in the, in the comment section also you can reach me on whatsapp uh, the number in the description is for whatsapp only it's not for phone calls so i'll see you guys on the next one stay safe and god bless